welcome back to more Jack and Daxter, the Precursor Legacy. Last time, we did all of Sandover Village except for one scout fly and a few orbs, and you know what? I went around and checked off screen, and they're right here. I, I completely missed this jump here. <laughs> I know, right? It's li it's literally the closest thing to me. There we go. Wabang. Obviously, there's still some orbs missing. We'll get them on in time. Oh, wait. Forgot the power cell. The most important thing in the world, and I forgot it. There's still some orbs around, lying around. I will get them eventually. Don't worry. Right now, we just need to focus on this. Speaking of which, how many orbs? Out of curiosity, is it, is it six? It's six. Oh, no, it's... Yeah, it is six. Wait. Wait, now that I'm here, are there freaking... Uh, are there... Was I wrong? Was there subtitles? No, there's no subtitles, darn. All right, well, we'll... Uh, we'll uh, go ahead and... Whoops. What do I do? Oh my god, circle is X in this game. Holy crap. The whole time I was pressing X. Alright, whatever. So we just went back to our save data. And our save data was right when we got that power cell. So we didn't lose any data. But it teleported me all the way back here. Holy crap. That could have been super bad. I need to remember. Circle is not to go back in this game. I'm playing PS4. By the way, this isn't like... Uh, yeah, it's, it's obviously not Xbox. This game wasn't on Xbox. Um, so, oh, that could have been bad. I need to remember. Triangle is to go back. Which it is triangle in some games. But circle's con the more common one for me. So I'm gonna, yeah, go ahead and go back, because we're gonna go to the Forbidden Jungle today. So let's go to the Forbidden Jungle, let's mess around with some people. Make some money as, as we go. We got over here, we got one of these thingies, that's cool. Got some Precursor Orbs, that's kind of cool. Oh wait, this is actually still Sandover Village. So even though the name of, pre, uh, of freaking Forbidden Jungle showed up, we have all Sandover Village. Okay, so whatever. Sandover Village, 100% complete, we got everything. We just need to give people the Power Cells and the Precursor Orbs, which obviously we'll do that in time. So, whoops, gotta remember to be careful about how I do things. Let's go ahead and climb. And just do this jump, I jump way higher. Go ahead and get these orbs. Ooh, rickety bridge. God, this whole game design just was so cool as a kid. Like, I, I've never been to a world like this. Like, see the snake? Screw this snake. Oh, God. Okay, uh, death perception is different for me. I did not see how far away that snake actually was. I'm gonna go ahead and go up here. These are just basic uh, enemies. They are, uh, I guess they're corrupted enemies or... They're not corrupt. I think the enemies here are just jerks. I think these are just like, hey, if you go into the jungle, obviously something's going to try and eat you. There, and these, thing, these are the things that are going to try and eat you. There we go. Got another one of these weird things here. We'll uh, deal with those later. If you fall into the water, the lurker piranhas will try to attack you. I do not recommend it. Uh, you could try to fight them off, but they'll, they'll just keep coming. Oh god, a lurker frog. I don't even know if that's its real name. I'm just saying names, guys. Alright, so lurker frog is dead. Let's go this way, then. Careful not to touch the water. If you touch the water, they will dash at you. They don't hurt you until they actually get to you, though. So there's like... Ah, ah, ah. Okay, okay. Just, just barely touched it. They're not mad about that. Who would get mad about that? No one. No one would get mad about that. Except customers. Customers at stores. All right, there we go. And now we can continue on our adventure. Damn it. I tried to do my, my other attack, but it, it crouched instead. There we go. I'm trying to do this one. Ooh, this is a lurker. That was the a Goomba of this game. The most basic enemy, a lurker. They're pretty cool, honestly. Uh, I dealt with him pretty quickly, though, so I guess it doesn't really matter. All right. Now we're going to do this. And what the heck is this thing? Is this thing blocking the... Okay, so that thing was blocking the light ray, which is why this magnifying glass wasn't working. Alright, so yeah, we gotta go over the jungle to make the eco beam work. Uh, these plants, you can attack them, but they just regrow. You are not strong enough to defeat them. Alright, so we gotta line up the beams. So that other circle thing we found earlier was actually a magnifying glass to, to freaking reflect eco beams. So now we gotta go to that one to find out where the next one is. And so on. So let's go. Okay, I gotta kind of glitch my way through that one. Oh god, I'm gonna hit the water. Ah, ah, ah. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. Alright, let's see. Got the next arrow pointing there. Oh, it's still coming up. There we go. I'm glad they had the arrow there. I would never find it on my own. Alright, there's the next tower right there. That's really close by. Oh my god, I almost fell into the water. That was terrifying. Okay, let's go ahead and grab this tower. Now, where do I go? Oh, it's literally right in front of me. Alright, that's easy enough. 
Now we just gotta cross that bridge and we get to that town. How many towers are there? What the heck? This is, like, really convoluted. You couldn't just, like, hook up three of these things to get the eco beam where they need to go? Does the eco beam, like, magnify and power the more you bounce it off? Because you would think it would get weaker. Alright, let's get that. Let's do this. Give me that. Yeah, we're getting a lot of these orbs. You do need to collect a lot because those villagers are greedy. They want as many orbs as you can give them. Hey, I hear somebody. Might need to go down there in a bit. Not just yet, but in a bit. Oh god, a lurker. Take this. Lurkers are basic. They only take one hit to kill. So don't worry too much about them. Let me get this. Let me get that. Let me get that. Let me jump. 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 And look at that. I miss not having blue eco on me because I can't attract anything. Do not hit those boxes. Those are basically nitro crates in this game. If you touch one of those boxes, you die. Or, no, I think you just take damage. But you, you take damage, which is... The, you know, it gets you to death. Eventually, you will die for doing that. So do not do it. Let me get this scout fly real quick. It just happened to be on the way to the thing. Uh, these plants are kind of annoying, so just take out the one that's in your way. All right, where's the next one? Oh, it's actually back the way we came. Okay. Seems easy enough. All right, so that one's uh, actually back the way we came, so I guess I should go back there. We should ask the fisherman down by the jungle river if we can borrow his speed. Oh, that's true. The fisherman. The oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. It's coming. <laughs> it's coming. All right. Jump down here. You will take damage if you don't press circle before you hit the ground. It's kind of a nice little gimmick in the game. I like it. And I think that's the last one. Yes. After, like, you could have done this with three of them. And an actual engineer could have done it with two. Alright, so we did it. We fixed the windmill. So now if we go talk to the mayor, he'll give us that power cell he owes us. Yeah, thank you. And that's exactly what Daxter just said. He's like, hey, he'll give you the power cell. The hell is the sun green here? Or is the moon green here? The moon's totally green in this world. That's, that's interesting. Alright, let's go over here. And now that we've completed that quest, we can go and go do another quest. Because this whole game is just quest, uh, quests on quests on quests for collectibles. And the next quest is down here. Here's the fisherman, everybody. What do you have in the basket? Nothing to talk about. Them monsters patrolling the ocean. Oh, no. He, that was his boat. Another goblin up my catch. No matter what I try, I can't seem to catch a single fish in this room. Really? Woo! Maybe it's your breath. Yeah. You think you can do better? Try swooping up river fish with a tiny net. I'll give you a power cell. If you can catch 200 pounds of them critters, and now let you with shrimp here use my speedboat. Yes, boat we need that speedboat. So your fishing boat's screwed, but you happen to have a speedboat. Ah, uh, yes, this mini game as a kid screwed me. I used to fail this mini game all the time. But let's hope I grew up. Let's hope I've grown up since then. If you miss 20 pounds of good fish, then I'm gonna take me net back. Yeah. There are poisonous eels in the you touch even one of those. Catch even a one of them boogers, and you'll poison the whole darn catch. Ah, uh, that's annoying. So yeah, you can only you need to catch 200 pounds of fish, and you're only allowed to miss 20 pounds. So good luck. I don't know why I'm uh, why I'm not allowed to miss more than 20 pounds. I think he's just a jerk. But uh, th yeah, that's what basically what we're doing. And this could be a little bit tough because it's very sensitive how you move it. So it's easy to move into a poison eel by accident. And you don't want to even miss a single one of these guys. Eventually, you will need to plan out the ones you miss. So I'm pretty sure you can 100% it, but I'm I'm the kind of guy that has to plan it out. I'm not I'm not freaking I'm not freaking a pro. I have to do do it the way I have to do it. There we go. Well, right now I feel like I'm doing pretty good. Got a little streak going. There we go. Ooh, got a big one. Oh my god, 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 oh my god. Okay, I'm getting them. I'm getting them. I'm getting them. <laughs> oh, missed one. There we go. Missed two. Holy crap, I only missed two after all that. That's crazy. Oh my god, no. Bad, bad, bad eels. Give me that big one. Oh, oh, oh. holy crap. Holy crap, that was close. This isn't as scary as it looks to- I mean, this is scarier than it looks to you guys. Remember, this is a super sensitive net. I'm only clicking the controller. I'm not holding it down. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, now I have to hold it down because if I don't, I'm freaking- oh God, there's so many of these guys. Oh god. 
stop. Yeah, we got it. All right, yeah, as a kid, that was hard for me. Probably because you're not as, you know, coordinated as a kid. Nice, we got access to a whole new area now because we got his boat. <laughs> he freaking dunked it. I love it. That's probably my favorite one is the power cell dunk. All right, let's do it. Come on. We, we Now that we've got all this stuff, we can continue to explore the Forbidden Jungle. And what in the Forbidden Jungle do they have other than forbidden ar artifacts like power cells, which aren't forbidden at all? And why am I saying this? I don't know. All right, so let's go ahead and continue on our adventure. Go down this way. We eventually have to fall down there to get those orbs and stuff, so don't think we're not going to go every single place in this Forbidden Jungle. Every little nook and cranny. All right, let me just do that. Just delay my land. Go ahead and go here. Screw you. Those lurkers can't jump up here, right? I don't think so. Yeah, there we go. Slam attack. Yeah, yeah, look at all my different attacks. I can do them all. I can kill you with all of them. All right, so what you need to do is you got to hit this thing. Go ahead and go here, and it'll create a bridge. Look at that. Hey, look, there's a jump thing down there. Hmm. Let me refill on Blue Eco real quick. Let me go down here. Oh, I can even refill on more Blue Eco. Oh, 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 Piranha got me. Oh, but there's a power cell. Screw the Piranhas. Oh, yeah, if you have a uh, Blue Eco in the water, it's way easier to get the underwater precursor orb, so I recommend doing that. Don't go too deep in the water. If you can't see the floor, you're gonna die. Okay, guys? You do have time to get away, but you're gonna die. So let me just go this way. And if you see another one of them... Yeah, there's the piranha. If it starts coming towards me, I'm out of here. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, got out. Alright, let me just go this way real quick. Just because there's orbs over here. Excuse me, Mr. Plant. Got some more orbs. Okay, gotta get this without hitting the nitro cards, or nitros. These guys hit, die before they hit the ground, so I'm not able to get them. Alright, I see there's a vent here. I need to I need to get some blue eco over here. And there's an easy place to get blue eco because we have a vent open way over here. Which I know it's kind of a it's kind of a walk. And I might not be able to make it if I'm not careful. There we go. There we go. Get through this traps here again. I love these trap setups. They're very cool. Yep, okay. Good thing for the roll. The roll gives you a little boost of speed. Just a little one. It's not too big, but you can use it. All right. Spin up the bottom. There we go. Got it. Spin, spin. Yeah, this is super easy to get. Never mind. There we go. Look at all those orbs. I feel like a man. A man with money. And a man with money can do anything. Almost anything. All right, let's go. Can't build a wall. Here we go. Jump. And now what do we do? Oh, what the hell? We're back at this place? Oh, wait, is that a... That's a... Okay, that's an orb door. Or, I mean, a blue uh, eco door. So we need to have some blue eco already stored up. So let's do this. Into this. Into this. Into jump. And then run over here really quickly. And the blue eco will open this door. And power cell. All right. So yeah, if that door doesn't open for you, it, I know it doesn't have a symbol to tell you that you need Blue Eco. It is super dumb that it doesn't have one. But there you go. You need Blue Eco to open up that door. Oh, I didn't even notice this before, but we can have, we could have gone here earlier. We could have just jumped here and then jumped here. All right, well, we're still in the Forbidden Jungle. We might as well go explore. And I like, I like to explore in video games. So not too much, but, you know, a little bit here, a little bit there. Excuse me, Mr. Plant. We need to get to the top of that Top of the tower, here we come. Where am I going? Where am I going? Okay. Where am I going? Oh, cool. This is where a scout fly is. Good. Wow, that's already six? Wow. Just by going on our merry way, we found six scout flies. That's pretty cool. So you need blue eco to activate these platforms. That's, uh... Oh, and I, there's sometimes there's blue eco hiding in, in crates. So there we go. Oh, wow. I didn't notice. I took a lot of damage. I need to heal myself. If I don't heal myself, I may die. Oh, wait. Is that the last one already? Look at that, everybody. Seven freaking scout flies just like that. Man, I love these games. The paths you take have the scout flies. That's perfect. I mean, I did a little bit of exploring, but that's—I right. I didn't feel like I did that much. All right, let's go. Jump. Oh crap, lurker! I have no health. I'm not fighting you right now. I need to get 50. All right. So if I jump on this, it should act. No, jump on it. Oh my god. I didn't jump on it. There we go. 
Uh, you got to be careful when moving on these things. If you jump around too much, you're not going to do very good. Because these are constantly moving. Wait, why do I even need to do I just do this. Yeah, what the hell? <laughs> There's no point in not doing what I just did. It's way quicker. Alright, and what's this do? This takes us into the inner sanctums of the Forbidden Temple. What is in the Forbidden Temple? What secrets does it hold? We will find out right now. Uh, oh, I need Blue Eco for this. Darn it. Alright, well, I can find some Blue Eco. Oh, I need Blue Eco for everything. Which means I have to go this way. Which also needs Blue Eco. Okay. Yeah, there's so many things to power, uh, to power that need powering. But we don't have any of the power, so we gotta go this way. Alright. Gotta be careful with the platforming here and there. Obviously, we want all the orbs, so... Wabam. Alright. Wabam. Do the circle at the end. It's just... It makes me more comfortable to do the circle. And there it is. Okay, cool. That was easy. We found out where the thing is. Now, for those of you that don't know, these are actually eco... Uh, not vents, but eco power sources. So the reason the blue eco vents have been closed around the world, like Kira was saying in the first episode, is because somebody closed this freaking vent here. So now that we powered it on, all the power of blue eco around the world should open up. Blue eco vents have been activated all over yeah, she just said it. I knew there was a way to turn them on. There must be places to turn on the other eco vents as well. Oh, nice. Okay, well, we'll go to those places eventually. For now, though, let's go through this door and uh, discover more of the freaking Forbidden Temple. Like, what's up here? Hey! Orbs, nice. And let's go here. Now that we're actually, now that we're fast, it's actually harder to platform because you, you move at a different rate and it's bad. Oh, we got our first boss battle. Heck yeah. Kind of a mini boss because this, I, you know what, we can count it. This is the boss of the freaking uh, Forbidden Jungle. He summons these creatures and he'll try to bite you. I just realized I came in here with like no health though, so I'm in trouble. Like, he's going to try and bite me. I just got to dodge it. I should have came in here with health. Okay, now that he's tired, he's going to leave himself open to heal. He's trying to heal right now. Uh, I'm going to go up there and smack him in the face. Hmm, he has no health bar, so we don't know how much we're doing. He summoned more of his creatures. Got to stay away from that bite. If you get too close to him, he'll just bite you. His creatures will put their shields down eventually. Ooh, I healed. Good. I'm healing off of this boss fight, just like how he's trying to heal right now. Good, I got a spin kick on him. All right, he's summoning three guys now. And he's still trying to bite us. Yay, yay. Not gonna let that happen. There we go. Got him. He's as long as you don't get too close, he can't bite you. If you're in this ring, he can bite you. So let me go here. Let me go here and punch to the face. And you better believe he's a dead man. Now, first things first. Get this. If you could see, he was actually on a blue eco vent. He was absorbing the blue eco to power himself, which is pretty cool. So this dark plant is dead, and now I'm gonna jump on his dead body. You need to jump on his dead body to get Precursor Orbs. But any kid would have jumped on his dead body, so this isn't too hard to find. I know I did. Oh, is that it? Give me more! No, he's dead. Alright, I can't punish him. He's already hurt. Let's go this way. Jump up here. And we got some more orbs. There we go. Look at that. How much have we done? Forbidden Jungle, we got everything but this. Return to the... Oh, wow. All we have to do is return to the mayor. And I've missed like 14 orbs, which are probably still in the in the freaking temple. So I might as well go get them. I probably just took a wrong path somewhere. Oh, good camera angle. Very good. That's my favorite camera angle. The one where I can't see anything. Perfect. I mean, I still made it here. So I guess it was perfect technically. But, oh, shit. <laughs> oh, damn. <laughs> but still, got to be careful. All right, let's go this way. Let's get ourselves back into the temple. As you can see, all the plants' tentacles are now dead. That, it, all the tentacles that were around the world were that gigantic plant. Pretty cool in my opinion. I like that. I like that little touch. But now that uh, he is dead, he cannot do that to us anymore. There we go. Climb up here. Gotta find out where were those last orbs. They're probably inside the temple, so I need to get inside. Can't be out on the outside like I am now. Like that. Go. The lurkers are still dead here because I haven't died. Once you die, I think enemies respawn, so you gotta be careful. Okay, and I kind of got pushed off the platform, but I'll get back on it. I'll get onto this one. Okay, never mind. <laughs> I was like, I'll get onto this one. No, I will not. There we go. There we go. Take me back in here, please. I believe I missed some of the orbs. 
Sometimes when you open the Blue Week events, they uh, it opens up more orbs that you can get, so I might as well check around real quick. So I, uh, I got this eco vent. It opens up this door. I did go through there. Did I go through here? Where, where is here? Oh, this is to go back. Okay. Well, maybe I just need to check around a little bit. Got some more blue eco here. Nice. Crap, 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 crap. Oh, wait, wait, wait. He said that there was a lot of stuff blocked off, so maybe I should go back the way I came. Yeah. Back up here. Oh, yep, there it is. And look at that. Oh, we're still missing an orb? <sighs> it's always four. It's always going to be four orbs. I got to remember that. Where the hell did I miss four orbs? Hmm. If I know my, if I know my Jack and Daxter, it's in the most annoying place possible. It's not here, but I'm still going to try. So I'm going to need to think. Where would the most annoying place possible be? Four orbs. Oh, crap. Hey, death by falling. Very, very nice. Four orbs. Let me see. There we go. Don't even need it this time. They're not in him. Oh, God. It's probably in the water somewhere. Oh, no. Anything but that. If it's in the water somewhere, that's going to suck. The water's the worst. Oh, yeah. Since I died, the enemies have respawned, so you got to be careful. Including all the Pranoclans. So is it, it this way in the water? Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, slam attack. Yeah. Yeah, slam attack works. Hey, happy man, dude. Do you know where some precursor orbs are? They're hiding over here. I always know that if I don't find them, they're in the water somewhere. Because that's like usually the last place I'll look. Ah, he's just a jolly old guy. He's like, yeah, I finally can feed my family. Alright. No, he ain't killing me. And if you guys are curious, these Lurker Piranhas can be killed. The, oh, there, there they are. Uh, the Lurker Shark, not so much. So here we go, everybody. We have found all the Precursor Orbs in the Forbidden Jungle. That is pretty cool. We found all the Power Cells, except the Mare one, which we'll go do right now, which is pretty cool. And let's go. Come on, come on. Yeah, roll, roll, roll. Roll. There we go. Gotta get some roll jumps in there. Can't hurt me because I landed in the water. Go ahead. Yeah, I'm just gonna roll jump my way all the way back to town because this is the quickest way of transportation. There we go. Look at that. This is so easy. Oh man, the music's kicking in. Do, 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 do. Hey, let's go check out old fish breath speedboat. At the oh, we could do that too. You're right. You're freaking right, Daxter. What the hell? Did I just fall on nothing? I just fell on nothing. I didn't even know that was possible. Mr. Mayor! Mr. Mayor! I, I fixed the problem. <laughs> oh, what a wonderful sight! I thank you. And the entire village will thank me. Uh, boys, you have restored power to the village and guaranteed my re-election. And for that, my boy, you earned a power. Suit. Yay! Thank you! Yeah, we got the dunk. We got the dunk animation. My favorite. All right, and here's 90 orbs. So uh, you uh, want to make a contribution? Yeah, just a little contribution for that power cell. Uh, a sizable one, I hope. Yeah. It's pretty big, isn't it? <laughs> oh, it's a sizable That's right. I, well, well, I, I just hope this power cell adequately represents. I want more than that. Too. I just realized this mare can't tie a bow. Yeah, we got the dunk one. <laughs> I'm loving it. I love the duck animation. I want it again. Where's it? Oh, who else needed money? Where's my uncle? Uncle. Oh, wait. This is Fisherman's house. Sorry. I gotta stop trying to rob him. Uncle, are you here? I see you two are back to make the trip. Yes. Good, good, jolly good. Hey, you have the uh, precursor orbs that we agreed on? Of course. On. I hope you put this hard-earned power cell to good use. Of course. Cheerio. Ta-ta. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. I will be going. You you do your adventure. I'll do mine. I want I want my, the next Jack and Daxter game to be about Jack's uncle and what he did with those ninety orbs, and then to find out he just spent it on drugs or something or went to like a strip club. That'd be pretty cool. I want a whole game around that. 
I want interactive controls, by the way. I want it on PlayStation VR with PlayStation Move. It would be perfect. It would be glorious. Alright, so I think that's everything that we needed to do. Uh, everyone else didn't want money from us, I believe. So, yeah, that's good. We just need 120 orbs for the Oracle. That's, le that's all that we have left. So, I want to thank you all for watching. Next time, we'll be going on to what should have been the first area, but I didn't go there first. Which is called... Crap, I've been here before, so it doesn't tell me. Sentinel Beach. <laughs> we'll be going to Sentinel Beach next time. Thank you all for watching, and goodbye.